So suppose we had this hash table, typically implemented by an array in C or something like that, with uh, six slots. And we had this hash, hash function here, which just takes a number and mods it by three. So let's suppose we wanted to insert these numbers here, one, five, eight, nine, and 10. So let's begin. So let's say we insert one. So we're just gonna use the hash function. We'll get h of one. So that's one mod three, which is just one. And we'll just insert it straight here. So we've inserted one. Now let's say you want to insert five. So h of five, that gives us five mod three, which is two. So that means we insert it in that in that index. Now we might have a problem. Say we want to insert eight, so we get hash function h of eight, h of eight. So eight mod three is two, and we see we already have something there in the slot, in the second slot. So that means we need to use, if we're using the linear probing method, we'll just put eight in the next available slot. Say we wanted to insert nine now, so just get h of nine. So nine mod three is zero. So we'll just put nine here. And now let's say we want to insert 10. So let's get 10 mod three, which is one. And then we see, oh no, there's something there. So then we say, okay, we'll go to the next available slot. So we go from here to here to, to here. And then we say, ah, oh, there's a free slot. We'll insert it here. And that's how we can insert data into hash tables.